we are joined by Connor Davis, the senior leader of this team. Connor, congratulations <laughs> on the win. This is our Zayo connection. First of all, how's your leg holding up, man? You played defense for the first time in a while tonight. How are you feeling? Uh, I'm good. You know, uh, a little tighter than I thought I was going to be at the end of this game, but made it through. Healthy, I'm good. And so I'm, I'm just glad to be back out there. And how did you feel, I mean, rounding third base and coming home on that single from Kai? It had to be in the back of your mind, right? Uh, a little bit. I was trying not to think about it, just trying to score, get a good read. I got a good read off the bat. and. Once my head was down, there was no stopping, so wasn't really thinking much about my leg. Let's go back to the first inning, though. You guys got off to an incredible start, exactly what you needed after last night. You got a pair of runs on the board, starting with the, uh, with your the RBI double by Campos, your RBI single. How important do you think it was for you guys to jump first today? Yeah, I think just after our loss yesterday, taking a little punch to the mouth, we just needed to come out tonight, swing it first, try and get on the board first, you know, help luck him out, help our bullpen out. So I think scoring first tonight is big for us and getting a little bit of momentum how for the big rest of the game. Was, how big was Luckham for you tonight, though? You mentioned it already. He's been huge for you guys all season. Oh, yeah. You know, I just think that the way he's been able to compete, you know, good or bad outings, you know, he, he stays in there as long as he, he's going to fight to come out, you know, or not to come out. <laughs> but uh, he competes. He gives us everything he's got. He shows his emotion. I love that about him. So I'm just really proud of him, honestly. It feels like a lot of your RBIs this year have been driving in Joe Lampy, and he's got a 20-game hitting streak going on right now. What is he doing? What is he eating for breakfast? What's working for him right now? Uh, you know, I think something that we talked about a little bit before the season, just sticking to a routine and sticking to your, doing your thing. And he has his own routine every single day, and he does his thing. Uh, it shows that's why he's playing the best uh, center field in the country, if you ask me. And you're about to uh, play your final collegiate home game tomorrow. You've played at two incredible baseball programs. What do you think the emotions will be like for you tomorrow? Shoot. You know, I'm just, we were talking about it a little bit earlier today, and I'm just thankful, you know, coming back from my knee injury, you know, transferring out here. I'm just grateful for Coach Bloomquist, the coaching staff here, to take a chance on me coming back from my sixth year. And, uh, you know, it is what it is. We got a couple more weeks left, uh, postseason coming up. You know, we're going to push, we're going to finish. So. I'm just grateful to be back, be back out here. Well, Grandpa, hope you have a great <laughs> time tomorrow. Best of luck, best health all the rest of the year, and uh, good luck for you guys. Thank you very much.